Hi everybody, welcome to another Beatles Finds video. This is Beatles stuff that I've had for weeks, maybe months, that I haven't shown yet. And some of them brand new. One of the newest items that I got here was a gift from my friend Kit O'Toole. Kit, thanks very much. It is a really cool book, perfect for this upcoming holiday season. The Beatles Christmas Time is here again. As you can see, it has a forward uh, by Bruce Spicer. Uh, the book is by Belmo and Gary Marsh. And this book is all things related to Beatles Christmas. Uh, and I know Kit also has some participation in this book. Just uh, anything to do with the Christmas season, Beatles related. All right, so this is really uh, pretty pretty fancy schmancy and I like the novelty of this you know because you don't usually get Beatles Christmas stuff uh, and this is brand new brand new release 2022 so check it out for you completists out there okay uh, keeping in the Christmas spirit I have a novelty record here by Judy and the duets this one is called Christmas with the Beatles a little early for me i don't really like getting into christmas until black friday at the earliest I like to get through thanksgiving first and then the day after you know we start all right here's ringo star a 45 or seven inch record from germany way to the world there's the sleeve there front and the back and the record itself i'll show you you can see it's at this one says, it's funny, this says made in the UK, interesting, but the the, the B-side is After All These Years, which is a great song. It's from the album Time Takes Time, which is really an essential Ringo album. I'm telling you, you you know, whether you're a Ringo fanatic or not, everybody has to have that album because it's really good, solid Ringo all the way through. But yeah, this, is, this says made in the UK, the sleeve says Germany, I, probably doesn't make a difference. I mean, I've had records that say made in Germany that are not from German, so. This is uh, the Beatles' 1962 live recordings. And let's see what's on here that I forget. We have, I saw her standing there and nothing shaking but the leaves on the trees. That's one side. There's the other side. Alrighty, next up, we have a magazine of the official National Beatles Fan Club. This edition is August 1964. It says the Beatle Bulletin. It's uh, the script for A Hard Day's Night. You know, it may not seem like a big deal now, but in the day, I'm sure that was really pretty important. You couldn't get things like that, really. There's the back of it. And... There are some uh, photos, but the main idea of it, I mean, there's a, you know, there's a shot from the movie. Back then, there was no uh, home video. You couldn't really see it on cable or anything. You had to have pictures. And this is basically the script. It's the, uh, the whole script of the movie. Okay, showing a, a lot of 45s today. I don't know if I've shown this properly in a Beatles Finds video yet, but I picked this up. It's Peter Best, Pete Best, formerly of the Beatles, sings Boys in Kansas City on Cameo, Cameo label. And this is the record. Uh, I met Pete Best October the 1st, a month ago today, uh, at a convention and i just showed this to him and i didn't know if he if he'd recognize it but he was familiar with it he remembered the cameo 45. okay and as long as i was there for a long time on my bucket list i had a kind of dream so to speak that i wanted to meet pete best and have him sign this really cool savage young beatles cover and there he was uh, finally got a chance on october 1st for him to to do that for me and uh really cool to have his autograph i mean i've had his autograph a few times 
uh, on various items, but not, I've never met him myself to get it personalized. And while I was there, I decided to get this one, which is also suitable for framing. It's a nice early picture of the Beatles, personalized. A lot of people don't like to get uh, autographs personalized because they figure the value goes down in the future, but I'm not in this for the value. I'm not in for reselling. I'm in it for me. You know, I want it for myself. After I'm gone, I don't, you know, whatever happens, happens. Okay, now we have a 12-inch single from the movie Give My Regards to Broad Street, Paul McCartney, No More Lonely Nights. And there's the sticker. You can read what it says there. This is uh, still sealed. It does say for promotional use only. Uh, this one has No More Lonely Nights, the ballad, the standard version on side one. And it has, uh, it says No More Lonely Nights ballad on side two as well, actually. And both of them are the same, <laughs> the same length of time, actually. So they're both four, minute, four minutes and 30 seconds long. So... Okay, next up, we have an album, which uh, I'm not going to take it out of this, really. You know, I, I often talk about how I had a collection for many years, and then I sold my original collection. I'm trying to get items back. It's been about 10 years now since I've been making videos, and 10 years since I've been trying to get items back from my original collection that I got rid of a long time ago. And I'm happy to say, I must be 99% there by now. And this was one item I wanted to have. It's uh, an album. I remember when I first bought this. It's an unofficial album called The Lost McCartney Album. It's a two-record set. It's a double LP. And uh, it has songs that were not included on the uh, official McCartney 2 release from 1980. It has stuff on here like All You Horse Riders, Blue Sway, Mr. H. Atom, uh, You Know I'll Get You, uh, Baby, Bogey Wobble, Secret Friend, uh, and uh, long ver longer versions of songs like Check My Machine and Coming Up. And Well, this used to, I remember when I bought this uh, originally, this was a really big deal because you couldn't really get this anywhere. But since then, a lot of these songs, if not all of them, maybe all of them, have been included on the official McCartney Archives edition of McCartney 2. So this is a pure nostalgia buy, just to get that record back. And I am so happy that I did. This here I'm going to show you is Band on the Run, Japanese issue with the Obi strip. And... What's really cool is that within this, of course, first of all, you have the standard poster, you know, this is the poster that came with the album. Everybody who has the album knows of the standard poster. It opens up more, but it's got a lot of snapshots from the band. But it also has these interesting items in here. These are... Japanese lyrics and also the American lyrics, uh, English lyrics, I'm sorry, not American, English lyrics as well. So this is really nice. This is really like uh, the main reason I think I got this. I like that it was complete and it had everything in there, you know. So this is really nice. Okay, uh, the last thing that I want to show here from my friend George. Hello, George. I have to be honest with you. Uh, I'm supposed to be listening to a couple of records from George, and my goal is to get it done by December 1st, so before the month of November is finished, to get those records listened to. Right now, I did a very short search around this mess, and I can't find the records, but I know they got to be here somewhere, George. Just take it. i got to find them. <laughs> they got to be here. But George, in addition to sending me uh, those records to listen to. Sent me this really cool item, John Lennon section. Today's free press, you know, it's just, just an advertisement that I think is really unique and cool. Also, this was in here, exclusive John Lennon book excerpts. Not really sure what the book they're referring to is, but uh, I think it's cool. It's a nice advertisement. John Lennon book excerpts, Sunday through Thursday. So that's it for this edition of the new Beetle finds I've gotten. 
Probably stuff here I still have to show that I haven't shown yet. Thank you all for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. Hit the bell so you're always notified when I go live. I'd like to talk to all of you out there. And uh, you'll always know when I have another video. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.